The video you are about to see was extracted directly from BIM After Dark Volume 2. To see more, head on over to BIMAfterDark.com and select Volume 2. So today I'm going to show you how you can create sheets with lightning speed. This technique utilizes the sheet list and creates placeholder sheets. It's very simple. So what I have here is a little project. If you go under Schedules, under the View tab, and click Sheet List, we're going to create a sheet list. So if I scroll down, we're going to add sheet number and sheet name to our list and click OK. Now you can see I have no sheets in this project. What we're going to do is we're going to create a bunch of sheets and we're going to manage them. So if I go to insert data row, you can see it starts with A101 and I can also type the name if I want. So test sheet. And now it's going to sequentially order these. So if I say insert data row, you can see it's A102, A103, A104. Let's say I want to start a 200 series. I type A200 insert data row, insert data row, you can see it's A201, A202, A203. So now I can sit here and I can pretty quickly create a whole bunch of sheets, A300, do the same thing, insert data row, insert data row, insert data row. And now I can name them here if I want, floor plan. And I can do a couple things, I can just copy and paste the text into each one of these names. I can say elevation, obviously if you need separate names you can. So now I can go through and just quickly create these sheets. Sections. I'm just copying and pasting. So now we've got a series of sheets. So now to convert these placeholder sheets from the sheet list into, into an actual sheet on the project browser, simply right click the project browser where it says sheets and say new sheet. Or in the sheet list, there's a little button up on the right hand side called new sheet. So if you click that, you can see all of the sheets we created and as placeholders are actually down on the bottom window. So now I can hold uh, shift, select them all, select the title block I want and click OK. And then Revit has already made all of those sheets for me. As you can see that can save a whole bunch of time instead of right clicking, new sheet, select, OK, etc, etc.